Welcome back, 547 now on Daybreak, and we're celebrating the return of the Buffalo Auto Show this weekend. It took a year off, a year hiatus due to COVID, but the newest makes and models, they're back at the convention center. With all of the snow, you might be in the market for a four-wheel vehicle. <laughs> Daybreak's Kevin O'Neill is there with more on the range of cars you'll find at this year's auto show. And one shocking new trend. All the makes and models are here. Time for your visit to infinity and beyond. The Buffalo Auto Show, after a year off, is in full swing today through Sunday at the Downtown Convention Center. Whatever your preferred vehicle type is, it's here from the cost-effective Kia to the 100K Corvette. Online car sales are growing, and hey, you know, call me old-fashioned, I don't like to buy socks online. I like to see stuff and touch stuff before I buy, and you can do that here. I, I think anybody that, that has gone, tried to go to a dealership, mm -hmm. and they can't find a car at the dealership, <laughs> so they can come in here and talk to the specialist and find out a lot about it instead of going online. Or not talk to the specialist. That's correct. You know, they can at least see it and then go back and look. That's Paul Stasiak, president of the Niagara Frontier Auto Dealers Association. I got a kick out of this Mercedes SUV slash camper, which comfortably sleeps four and uncomfortably sleeps 11. The growing trend here, it's electric. Woogie, woogie, woogie. Yeah, they're not a car of the future anymore, Kevin. They're a car of the present. We're going to have 17 of the newest DVs that are out. There's going to be 77 electric vehicles in our dealerships this year already. And then uh, it's just a growing trend. It's not a not a futuristic you know, vision anymore. Until 9, Thursday through Saturday, and until 5 p.m. on Sunday, info and tickets at buffaloautoshow.com. For Channel 2 News, I'm Kevin O'Neill.